Jesus made a very revealing statement in John chapter 7 and verse 7 about mankind. Speaking to his brothers, he said, The world cannot hate you, but me it hateth, because I testify of it that the works thereof are evil. The original sin of man is pride. Pride uh, goes before destruction, and a hearty spirit before a fall. Pride is our enemy. We do not like to be told that we're wrong, and it causes us to fight the wrong battles to defend our ego. When a young man goes into military service, the first thing they do is shave his head. Then they give him a uniform that's just like everybody else's uniform, and then they proceed to verbally abuse him. And in the old corps, they were known from time to time to physically abuse him. Why? Because it takes away his pride. No one has any territory to defend. Everybody's in the same boat. It's our pride that causes us to rebel against God and his commandments. Pride is what caused the archangel Lucifer to rebel against God and become Satan. You can read about it in Isaiah chapter 14. In our pride, we stand tall in our own eyes. And then comes this still, small voice in our mind and our heart telling us that we're wrong. It's the Spirit of Christ, his teachings, his example, his warnings about hell. And then his crucifixion by people just like us that did not want to hear the truth about themselves. That still small voice makes us uncomfortable. Uh, and so we move to quiet that voice. Some move toward Christ, some move away from him so that the voice grows fainter. We make a choice, either consciously or by default as time goes by. There's a song that says, life has many choices, eternity has two, heaven or hell. Uh, it's our choice. As they say at the varsity, what do you have? What do you have? It's our choice.